I've had psoriasis since I was five years old. It's affected my life in a huge way. Um, it was really bad when I was 12 years old, and I remember having it head to toe. 70% of my body was covered in um, huge, ugly psoriasis scales. I remember going to the pool and people um, looking at me really funny and actually getting kicked out of a pool once because, you know, watch out, it's a diseased girl coming in the pool and they thought I was going to spread it. Now still I you know, remember that feeling I had from it and just how insanely embarrassed and how sad I was and how depressed I became after that. Having psoriasis was really hard for me but it, um, I tried to uh, just overcompensate it with my personality, just be really optimistic and really happy and realize you know, I could have something that's a lot worse in this world but once I accepted it I knew that I could proceed to help clear it. I think it's really important for people to talk to their doctors and get educated with their doctors and if you feel like you're not getting the most out of your dermatologist that you're seeing right now then do not hesitate to go to somebody else. I went to three doctors until I found the medicine I take now that has cleared my psoriasis and allowed me to do my dreams and follow them as a model and being America's Next Top Model. So don't be shy to go out there and you know be knowledgeable about the disease you have and get all the information you can because if you really want to work with it and if you really want to do something about it, you have to take the steps necessary. You have to take the stairs instead of the elevator. I think it's really heartbreaking that a lot of people have to go through this. I know firsthand exactly what that feels like and I'm here to help the National Psoriasis Foundation. I feel really good to be a part of the family now and even though you have it, don't let it have you. And let your dreams come true. Don't let it stop you.